Western Christian senior Ashton Verbeek is rooted in tradition. When I got into high school, um, Western Christian was three-time defending state champs. Verbeek, she was born into it. Been playing since she could hardly walk with her mom as the volleyball coach and a former player at Western Christian. 16 of the last 17 years I've been in the state championship game. But the six foot two inch Wolfpack senior has done it her way. Ashton has tremendous physical gifts to be a great basketball player. Blazing a trail, enhancing her game, and leaving her own mark. There we go! A lot of them. I'm averaging about 27 points per game. Ashton is Western's all time leading rebounder with 957 rebounds, an all time leading scorer with 1,734 points. And that's not all. Ashton has been selected first team All-State, the 2A player of the year, captain of the All-Tournament team, and is one of 11 Iowa girls nominated as a McDonald's All-American. I have always loved basketball and I love the physicality of going down low and uh, driving hard. That's what I loved about it, always finding new opportunities to better my game. You do your thing when you're inside, you feel free to step. Uh, she'll go down uh, statistically one of the greatest players in our school's history and uh, we've had a lot of good players that have come through here especially in the last seven years or so. Having her come in as a freshman we knew that she had uh, a lot of skill and talent. It was all in the post. She really made a determined effort from her sophomore year to her junior year to get in the gym, expand her skill set, work on her outside shot, ball handling and uh, now that she's a senior she's become a pretty complete all-around player. But no athlete grows, not even a coach's kid, without some growing pains. Number 32, Ashton Beerby. In my sophomore year, we made it all the way to the state championship game, only losing by one right at the end. Beanstra, no good. Moss, the ball's tipped away. Final horn, and Unity. Losing that one by one just hurt so bad. A lot of the girls were in the gym already Monday morning, lifting and shooting and just getting better. We were so motivated after that. Five to play, three pointer to tie. And so my junior year, we were all really motivated to get back there and to finish it off. And that's exactly what we did. On her part, I see a very driven kid that is not going to let losing affect her or put her down. She's striving to win and get better. And yeah, so she lost. Well, tomorrow I'm going to work harder and get better so I can win. And I think that's just part of her character. Defensively, I want us to play great five. You keep battling for every rebound. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Pull back. One, two, three. Pull back. Come on, Emma. Ashton knows the game well because her mom's a coach. Put him in, Ash. Come on, kid. And it's a different sport, but it's the same concepts, right? I mean, you're always kind of dissecting what's going on in the game. And so I think that's why she does have such a high basketball IQ. Um, I'm glad she likes basketball as much as she does. You know what? I raised Ashton to, to love all sports. She came with me. She was in the gym with me. But as time went on, I could see her start to develop a love for basketball and the physicality that comes with basketball. And even as a mother, I could see just her passion for that game. I've been playing volleyball probably longer than basketball, honestly, because my mom was the coach. Her beat comes right back at her, and that one did get in. She's just got such a great arm swing and a great jump, and uh, really fun to watch. I've had some great times with volleyball, winning back-to-back -back state championships. My sophomore and junior years was just so fun, and getting to experience that with my mom. Of course, mom and daughter <laughs> hugging right near center court. She knows what it's like to win state championships. She's won more than most people ever will. I have been blessed with many, many great athletes. In my run here, we've won 10 state championships, and we've been to the state tournament. Um, this year was 17 years in a row. Keep competing. Wolfpack, one, two, three. Wolfpack. Good job, Kaylee. Way to box out. At Western Christian, we value each other's programs, and we support each other's programs, and, and we know if we work together, we can be successful in both sports, and we saw that last year when we were volleyball and girls basketball state champions in the same year. With tradition firmly established in Hull, Ashton now moves south and west 
to pursue a legacy of her own. Nebraska really stood out to me because I thought the coaches were really genuine and care a lot about me and I just felt like it would be the perfect place for me. And we just told her, hey, just be yourself and, and this is all part of finding where you want to be. Basketball is a tool that she gets to go to college for free and she gets to play a game she loves. That's where she's heading and we're happy for her. Love you, proud of you. Sports has taught me a lot about what kind of a person you want to be. You have to come in every single day working your hardest. The seniors that I've had growing up have really taught me that and that's why I put all the time into it to develop my skills and become the best I could because I watched those other ones before me do the same.